Hey everyone, Edward here at Windows Report and in this video I will show you what to do if you're getting the Epic Games error, sorry there was a socket open for both Windows 10 and Windows 11. So the first solution that you should always take in consideration is to simply check the Epic Games server status. To do this, open up your default browser and access the link that I posted in the description below. Basically, this is the official web page for Epic Games server status. As you can see now, all the systems are operational. So if you see this message, that means the problem is on your side which in turn means that you have to follow the next solutions in this video. But if you see that the systems are not operational, that means you just have to wait for a bit until Epic Games will be back on track. Then you can check if the problem still persists. Moving on, another useful solution is to run Epic Games as an administrator. So to do this, make sure that you have the Epic Games launcher icon on your desktop, right click on it, and then make sure to select the run as administrator option. You can then check if the problem still persists. So if you still get the error, make sure to follow up with the next solutions. Moving on, another great solution is to allow Epic Games through the firewall. To do this, press the Windows button, then simply type firewall and then select Windows Defender Firewall from the search results. Now in here, click on allow an app or feature through Windows Defender Firewall. And then if you want to allow any of the apps in this list, click on the change settings button. Now make sure to scroll down until you find the Epic Games Launcher and then make sure to tick the box under Private and Public so you allow it through the firewall. You can then click on OK to save the changes and then restart your computer and check if the problem still persists. And lastly, another useful solution is to troubleshoot the internet connections. To do this, press the Windows button, then select the settings icon and afterwards make sure to click on System on the left pane and then on the right side scroll down until you find the troubleshoot category and click on it. Now simply click on other troubleshooters and lastly click on the run button next to internet connections. Windows will now scan for any issues and fix them as soon as possible. However, as an alternative, we highly recommend you to try out Restoro, which is an app that specializes in scanning and repairing any issues with your Windows operating system faster than you think. At the same time, Restoro also repairs damage caused by malware, which is a great plus in functionality. So make sure to check out the link in the description below. And that's it! Plenty of solutions to consider. As usual, for more information and details, you can check the article in the description below. And if you enjoyed this video, just make sure to like and subscribe to our channel. Thank you.